Good morning guys and welcome to a four degree very cold UK morning. So there's snow on the on the road this morning, frost layer over everything else, and what does that mean? It's obviously time to do something with the car. <laughs> so I'm about to take it down to Mintmillan Motorsport, so they've done most of my support this year. As you've seen throughout the video, I've been down there a few times, they did my original flat floor setup, they helped corner weight it for me, and they've obviously helped me throughout my support. So what they're going to be doing is they're going to be uprating the brass components in the gearbox with their hardened steel version. So throughout the season there's been numerous times when you've been trying to get into second or into third and it's just not wanted to go in gear. Um, you've lifted off the clutch, put it back on and it just wouldn't go in third gear or second gear, which is a bit odd. And it turns out it's because of the synchros that are brass, they wear out as well as a few of the brass components and then they, as they wear, they obviously start to get rounded edges they don't engage or they crack and there's bits of debris in the gearbox so to try and prevent that next year and as I'm potentially looking to rent it out for maybe one or two rounds next year I thought it's best to try and obviously get it um, looked at now what I'm also going to be doing is I'm also going to be taking it in to have the diff preload checked so the diff at the back, some people do it twice a year I've never done it, um, so I'm going to try and do it and see if that makes any difference. car is back. So I've just picked the car up from Macmillan Motorsport so as you probably saw in just before this so this video has actually been formed up of three separate visits almost so dropping off the car to Macmillan Motorsport then we obviously after that we went back down again after we dropped it off and explained what we would like to be done to the car we then obviously went back and had a look at the gearbox so Andy Macmillan showed me all of the various components that he believes I should probably replace at the same time so seeing as the engine was out, the gearbox was out, the gearbox was being stripped to be upgraded so that the brass um, synchros were changed to steel ones. He showed me a few elements within the gearbox that actually should have been replaced as well. So I've replaced those along the way. So as I was saying, these um, synchros here, obviously you can see where they're meant to look like this, where it's one solid piece. Um, where they've actually cracked and snapped off and then are in the gearbox somewhere so that, that's been replaced this one's been replaced because of the wearing and obviously it's the these two brass synchros are being replaced with the steel ones and then we've got the lathe shaft components uh, and the input shaft and these are obviously the teeth are wearing in various places throughout so it was deemed that these were best to be replaced so I'm going to try and figure out a way of turning this into some type of 
lamp or candlestick holder maybe. If anyone's interested, let me know. You're welcome to it. <laughs> we'll try and do some um, testing in the new year to make sure the gearbox is good. The clutch feels good. We've a new clutch lay fitted as well. So just picked it back up. It's the 22nd of December. So nice little Christmas present to get the car back so I can do a little bit more tinkering over winter.